Great to be chatting to Sharon Cotson this morning. And the yard will get underway on Friday in race one with Ray Flambe, who can start improving. Morning, Nadine. Um, Ray Flambe, she ran a nice run last time. She was just still a little bit weak and very green. Um, she has strengthened up a bit and um, she has a nice draw. I am expecting a big improvement for her. Hopefully can fin finish in the money, but um, still might be looking for a little bit further. Next up in race two will be My My Apple Pie. My My Apple Pie. Um, first run for me on the 1600 Polly. Um, it was a little bit too far for her because she pulled really hard early and she had nothing to come at the end. She showed a lot of pace in that race, so we have brought her back to the 1300 and expecting a better run from her. In race three, Potsock steps out. Potsock, she's become very stubborn and um, she jarred up a bit, you know, in her last run. Um, she seems to have lost her way and she's not concentrating. Mm -hmm. So we've put a pair of blinkers on her and we've given her a bit of time to get over everything and we seem to have got her right now. So we're just hoping for improvement from her. In race four, for Florida Keys showed really big improvement last time out when stepping back off a break. Yes, um, Florida Keys needed her last run. Mm -hmm. um, We've got her a lot fitter now. She has got a, a nice draw and uh, a, a nice run expected from her. In race five, the two runners, this fellow Alpha Papa, and I've got to say he's one of my favourites, so definitely hoping for a big run from him. And he'll be racing alongside stable companion Van Gogh. Well, uh, Alpha Papa ran a cracker his last run. I really expected yes. the 1,000 metre to be too short for him, but he really proved us wrong. Um, he's fit and well and in a good space <laughs> and um, I think he's course and distance suited so yeah. expecting a big run from him. Van Gogh, he gave himself a bad knock in the last run and um, pulled up a little bit lame so we sent him to the farm for a break and we brought him back so you know we're starting him up in the 1300 but he probably will need the run. In race six, Grey Princess showed good improvement last time out. Grey Princess has been Tossing it in in the last couple of races, except the last one. Yes. The last one, she really put an effort in. Um, only it was, you know, it looked like she faded out, but it was actually too short for her because everything sprinted past her. Yeah. So we have put her over the further, and hopefully she can concentrate and produce a better run. In the feature of the afternoon, the warmer handicap, the yard will step out wings of fire and ideal angel. And Sharon, both these ladies can be very competitive. Um, yes, I actually think I have two really nice runners in the warmer handicap. Um, Wings of Fire has done nothing wrong. She got um, caught out the last 100 metres. You know, she was pulling quite hard yes. early on. And so, you know, she had to go when she went into the straight. And she just, that extra 100 metres just caught her out. Um, Ideal Angel, she was also unlucky in her last start. But uh, she is on better terms with um, Vision on us that beat her. Yes. And um, I think it's a very open field and I think, you know, it's, it's quite a competitive field, but uh, I think both of mine have got good solid chances. Once again, I do think that's going to be a lovely race. In race eight, the final of the afternoon, my boy Reese, he's found form and he's holding it gamely and get it done. We'll be back off a break. Um, my boy Reese, as you mentioned, he is holding his form now. He should enjoy the, the 1900 metre on the poly and I'm just hoping for a follow up on his last run. It was a cracker. Yeah. Uh, get it done. She hasn't run um, since March. She, she's just been battling with draws so she finally pulled a semi-decent draw here. Um, she does prefer this trip to the 1600 mm -hmm. so expecting a good run from her. The only issue is she might just need it. There you have it, and uh, definitely don't be leaving Alpha Papa out. Thanks very much to Sharon. <laughs>